What's up, everybody? Welcome to the channel. Glad you stopped by. My name is Hassan Chavaz. I'm a certified health and, health and wellness coach, as well as a, a physical fitness trainer. This is a short video entitled Health is Well. As we discuss on our channel often, in fact, one of the things about our channel is that you have to be fit on all four levels. In that thing, good health means not only the absence of diseases in the body, but good health means a complete physical, mental, social, as well as spiritual well-being of an individual. So to be healthy, you need to be physically healthy, I mean, you need to be physically fit. You need to eat those foods that will enhance your uh, physical health. Mentally, you need to be healthy, healthy mind. Socially, you need to have friends. You need to be, you need to be involved in a social circle. And you need to be financially fit because worrying about being stressed about money will cause you to have physical health problems. It will cause you to have mental health problems. Now, let's look at some of the benefits of being physically fit, which is the first level. By being physically fit, you're automatically healthier. You have, you're, you have a more healthy body, so you're being healthier. You increase your chances of living longer. You reduce your chances of depression. You have stronger muscles and bones, and you achieve or maintain a healthy weight. In order to be physically fit or phys phys physically healthy, it only takes about 60 minutes of movement, 60 minutes of working out daily, one hour. Just devote one hour to walking, one hour of uh, bike riding, one hour of running, one hour of walking on the treadmill. Whatever you choose to do, just select one minute. I'm sorry, 60 minutes. 60 minutes, one hour. I meant to say one hour a day. Just continuous movement. Do that daily, every day. 60 minutes of co continuous movement. You can play basketball. If you like to play basketball, go out, go to the gym or go to the park and get, in, get involved in a pickup basketball game. It can be volleyball. It can be anything, but do yourself a favor and work out at least 60 minutes a day. Get you 60 minutes of good cardio, good, good fast-paced walk, something. Do something to move your body at least 60 minutes daily. And then begin to clean up your diet. Begin to, begin to try to eat healthy, try to make more sound choices when it comes to food. Try to uh, cut back on certain things. Do that before your doctor tells you you have to do it. If you eat a lot of sugar, a lot of processed sugar, cut back on it. You don't have to stop cold turkey, but begin to lay off of the um, processed sugar, white sugar. Begin to remove processed foods from your diet. Begin to slow down your fast food intake. Begin to eat fresh vegetables, fresh fruits. Try to, to prepare your meals at home if at all possible. But begin those things that will cause you to eat clean. And by eating clean, by getting that 60 minutes of play or 60 minutes of working out daily, you will automatically 
be healthier and be wealthy because the more healthy the more healthy you are the healthier healthier you are the more, you're more apt to produce more if you're not mentally fall you're going to produce more and one of the ways of avoiding mental fall is to eat healthy work out all those activities eating healthy working out will cause your mind to function better your mind to be clearer it'll, it will help you to eliminate mental fall if you have mental fall also you must read something daily you should read, read at least 25 pages of something every day make it your goal to read at least 25 pages of a physical book daily reading helps the mind to comprehend to to uh It helps the mind to figure out things. It, it works the mind. Reading helps your mind to work. So you want to put your body to a to physical movement. You want to put your mind through physical movement also every day. So read something, at least 25 pages of something daily. If possible, read it in one setting. Play uh, word games, do crossword puzzles. Always do something to cause your mind to work. Work your mind like you work your body. And work both of those at least for an hour daily. I would advise you to do that. I would advise you also to drink clean, healthy water. And what I mean by healthy water, I mean water is not contaminated with pesticides with um, other contaminants and do that drink spring water or drink water that has been purified with a purifier a real purifier real purified water and water that has a pH level at least 7.5 so you want to have water that's alive. You want water that has life. So you want water that has a high pH level. You don't want acidic water. Because the water you get out of your tap, your tap water, it is not alkaline water. You want to have alkaline. So because the part that eating clean, you want to be, you want to move to an alkaline diet. You want to move to a diet that's high in alkaline, and that's your fresh fruits, your fresh vegetables, especially your green vegetables, high alkaline. Green fruits, high alkaline. Put lime, a little lime in your water. That helps to raise the pH. Thereby causing the water to be more alkaline but do those little simple things those are simple things begin to eat clean avoid processed food cut down on uh, fast foods try to avoid white flour white sugar white rice uh, try to avoid those things walk run jog ride a bike whatever do something for 60 minutes every day read something every day at least 25 pages or something read something daily do word games crossword puzzles etc keep your mind occupied and pray and i can't stress this more pray pray daily no matter what your religious faith pray meditate daily so with that we're going to leave you if you're looking to um take it to the next level you need you, you want to consult with a health coach
My information is on the about page. And it'll also be in the link in this uh, in the description in this video. Remember, health is wealth. The key to being wealthy is to have good health. Because if you have good health, if your mind is clear, your body is healthy, and you are emotionally healthy, you can accomplish great things. You can do anything you want to do. There's no limit on what you can do except the limit you put on yourself. So strive to be the best you you can be. Strive to be an optimal health. Strive to be the best version of yourself that you can be. So ask you, uh, if, you, if, you're, if, you're, if it's your first time here, subscribe to the channel, like and share the video. And if you've been here more than one time and you, but you haven't subscribed yet, please, please subscribe. We try to post very informative videos to help you improve your life. So until next time, my name is Hassan Jabaz. This is Sacred Life Connection Health and Wellness. We also have, have a podcast, so if you want to listen to it, our podcast is by the same name, Sacred Life Connection Health and Wellness Podcast. You can find us on Spotify and any other place where podcasts are available. So until next time, peace.